Today on Tips Tuesday, we're talking about one secret to help you achieve exactly the outcome that you're looking for. Whether you're buying a home or selling a home, it's really easy to lose sight of, but if you keep it in the front of your mind, you'll achieve exactly the outcome you're looking for. Stay tuned, we'll talk about that next. Hello everybody, welcome back. I'm Gary Moss with Moss & Associates and thanks again for joining me back on this Tips Tuesday. Again, today we're talking about one secret to help you achieve exactly the outcome that you're looking for. And like I said, if you lose, it's easy to lose sight of, but if you maintain it, uh, you'll get exactly what you're looking for. That secret is focus. Earlier today, I was talking with one of my mentors and that was the whole basis of our conversation was focus and the 80-20 rule, meaning focus on the, there's 100% of things that will take your focus, but only 20 if you focused on that will help you really achieve the outcome that you're looking for. That really also applies to either buying or selling real estate, right? And almost anything in life. And here's how, you know, as a buyer, especially in today's market, it's really easy to lose focus and get distracted on exactly what you're looking for. Because again, you set out with a purpose to maintain a certain budget or be in a certain area or neighborhood or get this uh, similar type of features in a home that you're looking for. But after seeing house after house and also not being able you know, making offer after offer and not getting that home, sometimes people then start to change their focus. They change different neighborhoods and they change, you know, they, they end up uh, settling. Now I'm not saying by all means, don't, uh, you know, don't be open to adjusting your criteria because maybe it's really not out there what you're looking for. And you should look at that at the very beginning and define that, that outcome and focus on it. But at the end of the day, don't settle. Just because like the market is going crazy, there's not a lot of inventory does not mean unless you're in a pressing situation that you have to give up the focus for the right house that you're looking for. Similarly, when you're selling a home, there's a lot of things that's gonna take you away from the big picture. The big picture is the next step. The reason why you wanted to sell the home in the first place. Are you buying another home? Is it financial? Is it just getting a different lifestyle, etc.? Focus on the big picture because so many times during the during the transaction or getting the home ready, there's just so many things like doing all the landscaping and the painting and all the stuff and all the hard work that it takes to get the home to the market and then having to put it on the market and do showings and then also get you know repair requests and people picking apart and asking for credits and there's just so many different things that can distract your attention and sometimes emotion comes into it and you lose sight of the big picture. So by maintaining that focus, you uh, again can release yourself from worrying about all the little details and stay focused on the bigger details. Let your agent deal with all the others, uh, with all the other hoo-ha that that uh, really just isn't worth your time in uh, you know in thinking about and stealing that energy from you and focus on the big picture. So again, just to wrap it up today, the big picture uh, secret is maintain focus on exactly what you want. Forget about all the other stuff trying to steal your attention, and you will win all day. If you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below. I'd love to hear from you. We'll see you again next week on Tips Tuesday.